Hi everyone and welcome back to Interview Chronicles season 4. Today we are in the 33rd episode of this series and we have Atharv here with us who has been recently placed at Honeywell as a part of his campus placements at VIT. He is here to share his interview experience with us but before we talk to him let's look at the eligibility criteria. So all students belonging to all BTEC branches were eligible provided they had a 60% or a 6 CGPA in their 10th, 12th as well as in their pursuing degree with no standing arrears. Apart from this, there was another condition given that is the student should not have had an arrear in his college life. So let's go ahead and talk to Atharv and understand his experience. Hi Atharv, firstly welcome to my hello. channel. Hello, uh, hello. Congratulations hello. on your placement. Thanks a lot, thanks a lot. So would you like to introduce yourself first? Yep, sure, sure. So hello everyone, my name is Atharv Bogle. I am originally from Pune, Maharashtra. and uh, i'm currently studying as a computer science student at velour institute of technology i'm currently in my fourth year and my college cgpa is 9.12 currently okay uh, as far as my technical stack is concerned i am a machine learning and data science enthusiast considering the same i have done few interesting projects and i have done two internships okay one internship was in a like automobile startup wherein i used to deploy machine learning models on uh, live automobile machines and my second internship was in indian space research organization as a data analyst okay. so that has been like a milestone for me right, right. Uh, considering the same uh, recently i have been part of the placement process for animal technological solutions since i am a cs student uh, it was a nice placement process and finally i am placed at animal okay Thank you. that's great thank you so much um yep. you cannot tell us about the placement process like how many rounds were there and what they comprised of yeah so uh, hanivel came at uh, like came on 23rd of uh, september uh, they had a pre placement talk wherein they basically introduced about the company we got to know more about uh, like it's a automation it's it's a leading company in automation industry hmm. like more pro, mostly it is concerned with aerospace technology development mm-hmm. and uh, developing various automation tools so they came for various roles uh, mostly it was one uh, for cs we had a technological uh, solutions role and for ec and other branches we had role for automation mm-hmm. uh, and uh, ec related roles so i opted for uh, as i'm a cs student i opted for the technological solutions role so they had uh, online test as the first round okay. of uh, basically they uh, gave the online test for all the applied students so hmm. it was an online test for 1 hour on hacker rank okay so we had uh, three coding questions uh, two of them were uh, easy to medium and one question was uh, from graphs which okay. was hard okay so people who were able to solve three questions completely were uh, shortlisted for the next round okay so from cs particularly we had a uh, around 400 people hmm. got listed for the interviews hmm. uh, amongst that we had uh, then company came back to us on 30th of uh, oh, sorry september hmm. uh, with the short lists so we had to uh, like prepare for the interviews and the time time schedule was shared so hmm. we had a 20 minute interview hmm. uh, wherein uh, according to me the interview was mostly oriented with your technical background hmm. the internships which you had hmm. and then few uh, questions on oops dbms and hmm. operating systems okay. so it was overall kind of uh, interactive session and hmm. i would say that it was more resume based it, it was but of course like we had only 20 minutes so they were more focused on whatever you have did in your past and how much compatible you are with the company mm-hmm. so uh, after the interviews uh, we were uh, they were planning to have a hr round but mm. uh, for some reason they didn't had it so we had only uh, one interview round okay. and then uh, they they shortlisted uh, almost like 30 people out of 400 as the final selected student so we got the final list uh, okay. the same day Oh okay 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 that's great that's yeah. great congrats again and yep. thank yeah you. thank you for sharing your experience yep thanks a lot yeah so do you have any suggestions for your juniors or anything that you learned from your experience yeah so basically uh, i will talk i like to i would like to talk about cs particularly okay. so mm-hmm. if you are considering that uh, if you are planning to have a good uh, super dream job hmm. like a com- specifically company like hanivel so hmm. m- 
I think according to me, they were more concerned about how much you are good at applications, mm. how much you are good at your past experiences. So mm. my first and foremost suggestion should be, uh, would be like you should be very well versed with your resume, mm. whatever projects and internships you are you have done, you should be quite well at explaining them mm. because mm. Uh, it is live working experience which you which will help you later in the company also. Mm. So uh. it was mo- like focus more on your resume. Later on, considering the coding skills, like practice on lead code, like uh, 200 questions on like uh, top DSA sheet on lead code is more than enough hmm. for Honeywell at least. Hmm. So uh, yeah, and then for core subjects, I followed uh, DSA like core subjects. I followed sheets available on YouTube channels, so okay. you can go through that and hmm. then practice by yourself. Hmm. Uh, write down things which you remember, like mm. few important concepts only. Mm. Considering mm. my interview experience, they asked me only basics regarding DBMS, OOPS and networks. Mm. So mm. even if you go well through interview bit and all, mm. it will be quite helpful. Okay. Even Geeks okay. for Geeks as well. So mm. uh, it's around about completely a uh, two to three months process when you will get completely ready for super dream jobs. Okay. That's it. Okay. 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 That's great. That's great. Thank you, yeah, so thank you so much for sharing your experience and for all yes, the suggestions. Yes. Yes. I'm sure thank it's so going to help many people. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, all the best for all people. Thank you all for watching. Please do like, share and subscribe. And let me know which company you would like next.